Not much good on area highways, just lots of bad and ugly. And right now, Highway 126 west of Eugene at Walton is closed due to a wreck. Wrecks reported multiple wrecks on Highway 58 and Interstate 5. And traffic remains slow on I-5 in Albany after a chain of wrecks about 10 hours ago. As KZI 9 News reporter Rotor Cross shows us, 25 to 30 cars crashed within just a half mile of each other. A very, very frightening experience. Uh, you just think, you, are you going to overturn? Is another car going to come up on top of you? This driver says she was lucky. She only hit the ditch. Officials say 25 to 30 cars crashed on Interstate 5 this morning just outside of Albany, causing the interstate to back up for miles. Driving home from a long 12-hour shift as a registered nurse. She was driving south on I-5 towards Albany around 8 o'clock this morning. And I was driving a little slower because it was darker and, and uh, snowing. And the, all of a sudden, the cars in front of me started fishtailing off to the side of the road. She says she lost control and hit the ditch. Seems like Albany, Corvallis area were the bullseye once again, just like on December 6th. ODOT says nobody was seriously injured in today's crashes, but one woman was transported to the hospital for minor injuries. Several vehicles, including the semi truck behind us here um, spun out in the uh, snow and ice and once that happened a chain reaction accident occurred. Crews say I-5 was backed up four to five miles and the southbound lanes were closed for hours. Towing one after another all our trucks are on I-5 right now OSP requested that uh, we have all our trucks to try to get I-5 open. One towing company says this is the worst pileup it's ever seen during a storm. It's, it's terrible. Um, I, I've never seen anything quite like it. ODOT says it's a good reminder that if you have to drive in this weather, be prepared. We'll make sure they're fully fueled anytime they leave in a storm system, have extra clothing, have some snacks with them, some water. Not only that, but be prepared to stay in one spot for a long period of time. Bring blankets, sleeping bags, you know, always carry that extra where you might have to shelter in place, so to speak. ODOT says traffic is still congested in the southbound lanes. In Albany, Rhoda Krause, KEZI 9 News.